Hello, let me show you what I've done. So the first thing I've done is that I've added in life support, but let's go ahead and build a base to put life support in, because otherwise it'll just push out all of our air into deep space, which isn't terribly useful. Alright, so here you can see that I've built a simple tubular capsule in deep space, and there's really nothing in it except a life support module. So let's go ahead and see what we can do with this life support module. It says there's not enough oxygen, so let's go ahead and grab this oxygen tank here and uh, put it in one of these canisters. There you go. So it's dumping oxygen. You, can, you might be able to see a blue line going up here saying that there's oxygen in the room. Uh, normally there wouldn't be just oxygen, so let's go ahead and put in some nitrogen. Alright, there we go. And now you probably can't hear it, but there is the sound of an air conditioner starting up. The uh, It's getting very loud. The life support has a, has a noise it makes, but it only makes noise if there's atmosphere. And it makes more noise the more atmosphere there is. You can see that over here, our atmosphere is steadily increasing. And as we get closer here, you can see that it's feeding in. So that life support system has to fill all three of these rooms. Um, and if you're wondering why my voice is going loud and soft, it's because this is a really loud sound effect when I get it close up. Alright. So there we are. Uh, we are. We now have filled the area with life support, and you can see that uh, we have oxygen 56 and nitrogen 559, so that's what's left in those tanks. So that's what I've accomplished today. Uh, I've built myself an actual life support system uh, and the foundations of much more complicated uh, systems.